what's up guys thank you so much for tuning in all right y'all so for today's video as you can tell by the title i will be giving you guys an updated bmt packing list and this list can go for every gender everybody can do or pack these specific items if they need it or if they want it so i did post a bmt packing list before but that was before i actually went to bmt and now i have went to bmt so here's some stuff that you need and you don't even have to pack as much stuff as i put on there so and i wrote all of this while i was in bmt so you already know you got the good stuff so let's go all right first things first bring a book or a bible or an extra notebook you're gonna need all that stuff because you're gonna be super duper bored and you can get some of that stuff when you go to the mini mall i think but it's rather you have it so you don't have to spend the extra money so like if you have a comic book i would recommend bringing it just keep this stuff in your security drawer and you will be fine um do not leave it in your backpack or your wall locker just like out in the open the notebook or whatever type of book you guys are reading definitely take that with you i brought my bible because your girl needed it your girl needed some jesus while she was in bmt because bmt is taxing on your brain an extra notebook is just to like when you want to write some stuff because a lot of girls didn't have their notebooks for some reason i brought an extra notebook so but don't pack too much stuff because you're gonna have to carry it um to your dorm and your dorm has stairs and you have to carry it in your left hand and if you're not left-handed it's gonna be a struggle so pack extremely light necessities only i require that as a necessity a book that's a necessity bring pads tampons bring feminine hygiene stuff um definitely pads and tampons for sure though because a lot of girls were having to share because some girls didn't think that they would get their period while they were in bmt wow don't make that mistake bring your stuff so you don't have to use other people's stuff and always asking for stuff even though somebody will give it to you just you want to have that stuff on deck so you don't have to ask for it constantly and stuff so yeah and then bring feminine wipes and disinfectant wipes i brought disinfectant wipes not expecting to really use them like that but i use them a lot see like i'm the type of person if i go to the restroom and or the latrine and i can't sit on the toilet seat like i either have to tp it or wipe it down with the disinfectant wipes now that worked really good i don't know how healthy that is it saves a lot of time when you can just wipe it down instead of having to tp the toilet just wipe it down sit on it go about your business you know or if you want to wipe down your handrails or anything else your wall locker whatever somebody's gonna need it too so you just want to have that in deck and feminine wipes yeah because the tissue is very very harsh um at bmt you won't be able to bring them when you go to beast i know that for sure but you're gonna need it while you're in your dorms and stuff because it's just something good to have the tissue is very harsh and you're gonna have them i had some so yeah all right you don't have to bring this but you can it's this thing called poopery it's a spray thing i don't know if they you should be fine i think as long as you keep everything in your like hygiene bag bring poopery because you're gonna be funking up the bathroom when it's time for you to release the bile out of your gallbladder you know what i'm saying um you're gonna need that because it's gonna funk up and people are gonna be like it smells like somebody's you know doing something i don't know it's just embarrassing for me you don't have to bring it but poopery is something i would definitely pack next time and then i put do not bring socks you don't need socks actually but bring one pair and that'll be the one on your feet but you don't really need socks because you'll have your pt socks 24 7 most of the time and then you'll have your ocp socks and your dress blues socks so you will have socks on deck bring the ones that are on your feet and then go from there and also put do not bring more than two shirts so the first day you get there you're gonna have two days i think before you get your pt clothes your pt gear so you do want to bring maybe get an extra shirt maybe just one shirt you do not have to bring two three four five pairs of shirts you don't need them at all i promise you just bring two shirts at most and then i put bring in soles please bring some gel insoles or something memory foam or something because your feet will be hurting i promise you your feet will be hurting so much like it's not even funny actually just so you don't have to wait to go to the the bx to get your stuff you want to have your your insoles already you know what i'm saying you're gonna need them oh because if you don't have your insoles i'm not gonna say this happened to everybody but you gonna contract some bunions i'm, I'm telling you so yeah bring insoles bring lotion or a really moisturizing oil a really moisturizing lotion though for sure you're definitely gonna need this if 
you don't take anything from me bring an extremely moisturizing lotion or you can bring this shea butter right here like because your hands will be cracked for days it will be so dry and for no reason like because you have to wash your hands so many different times at bmt your hands is what gonna take the most damage like i just now recently recovered my ashy dry hands it's been about two months since i've been out of bmt and i just now recover them like it's no joke please pack some very moisturizing lotion very 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 moisturizing lotion all right and then bring extra black masks me i had an issue with the masks that they gave us because they were super duper big like i know they're supposed to fit everybody's face but that was like it was hanging off and every time we would march i would have to adjust and ask for permission to adjust to fix my mask because it was always falling off bring extra black mask i would say cloth don't get the other mask cloth black mask because they'll let you wear those so what i had to do was cut mine and tie it back up and i didn't like that just so you don't have to cut yours and do all this stuff just bring extra black mask that you know will fit your face so yeah because they might not fit the mask that they give you they will most likely not fit bring minimal makeup you don't have to bring your whole entire makeup bag bring stuff that you know you're going to use when you're wanting to take pictures and keep in mind that you're probably only gonna have five to 10 minutes, maybe 15, maybe 30. I don't know who gets that lucky, but bring minimal makeup. So like minimal, minimal, minimal makeup. You don't need your whole makeup bag. And then you wanna bring your hair products, even though they give you the two in ones or three in ones or whatever, for this type of hair, you, you, you don't wanna do that. Um, it's not really good for our hair. Use what's good for you, bring the like travel size, versions of it and you should be fine I, I didn't wash my hair at all at bmt because no i was gonna wait till i got to tech school to do that because i was not about to do it in those showers yeah it was just i was gonna be in there for a very long time and i didn't want to waste time or like get in the way of people i was very considerate you know what i'm saying so like bring your gel bring your comb and don't forget your bobby pins and your rubber bands and your brush all of that is pretty much what you're gonna need um you don't really need like curling products unless unless you want to curl your hair or like twist your hair up and then take it out the next morning but you won't have time to do majority of the stuff just bring your travel size shampoo and travel size conditioner maybe leave-in conditioner if you plan on washing your hair you don't need to bring your own soap really because the soap that they give you is not that bad and um and it'll last you so you don't need to bring it to bmt make extra room you don't need to bring soap unless you have really really sensitive skin but other than that you should be fine you don't need a clipboard and you don't need a ruler my mti was like y'all better not be using clipboards to get these hospital corners i threw away my clipboard so fast um well i stopped using it i took it out of my wall locker and i put it in my civilian luggage i was like okay let me stop i only use it like once and my bed was not the best even still with that i didn't like taking it out because we have a time limit where we do certain stuff so i just like let me just tuck this in as best as I could. And I was pretty much the only person with a clipboard. So my suggestion, you don't need to bring it, leave it at home, leave it at the store, don't even buy it. Do not bring a clipboard or a ruler. And you only need one pair of pants along with your two t-shirts or one t-shirt. You only need one pair of pants. Um, do not pack all these pants, like save room. You do not need them, I promise you. Just bring the pants that you're gonna wear when you go to MEPS. Wear that throughout the two days that you're gonna have them at BMT. And you can wear those pants. When you go to the hotel, keep those pants on. And then when you go to MEPS, keep the same pants on. And then when you ship out to BMT for the first night, keep those pants on. Like, it doesn't matter. They're not gonna do extensive stuff. You're not gonna be dirty unless you're a very messy person. Um, and you know you're gonna spill something on yourself, bring one extra pair of pants. But that is it. That's all you need. And also, it doesn't matter which color your shoes are. There was a dude at BMT with highlighter sneakers on. Um, it really doesn't matter. You can wear any color. You're gonna stand out regardless, but... If you don't want to stand out, just get a neutral color, but it really doesn't matter. They're not going to get on you if you have on neon colored sneakers. Also, if you don't have sneakers, you can also wear um, your Converse or your Vans. No sandals at all. No sandals and no heels, but you can wear Converse, Vans, regular running shoes. It really doesn't matter. Just no sandals and no heels. No cleats. Also, 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 please, you are going to be homesick. You're going to be, you're going to miss your area. You're going to miss your old life pack a picture book or like i forgot what they're called like a, a book 
full of pictures so you can see what the outside world is looking like because you're gonna feel so isolated i promise you you are if you don't take anything from this video bring a picture book bring a picture book please okay you got it picture book cool nice that will make your experience at bnt 10 times better i guarantee i wish i brought one i didn't bring one because i didn't have time i did put pictures in my notebook but that was not enough they weren't recent updated photos either so yeah bring pictures from your instagram take just go around to, if you don't have an instagram go around take pictures with your entire family take pictures of the world the trees the leaves the stoplights mcdonald's i don't even like mcdonald's take pictures of restaurants um your favorite restaurants whatever parks your dogs your cats your fish your bedroom take a picture of your room i promise you you're gonna need it well you're gonna want it it's gonna comfort you take pictures of things that you see on a daily and you won't miss it so you can always look back at those pictures they will let you have a picture book and everything so it doesn't even matter as long as it's nothing provocative bring one a couple girls had some and i was so jealous i was like why didn't i think of this i need this like i was crying missing my family my room everything y'all mm -mm. my game take pictures of memes guys you will want to laugh and look at stuff that makes you laugh like take a picture of the games that you play your memes take picture of memes i'm telling you i was deprived and i was missing everything take pictures of food everything i'm talking everything because when i if i decide to enlist again that's exactly what i'm gonna do and that's on period all right bring a watch duh my watch vibrated please hold on hold on hold on please get a watch that vibrates i don't know what y'all thought this was when you brought a watch to bmt that made noise alarms and doesn't have a vibration mode or a silent mode i don't know what y'all was thinking like bringing it to bmt because it's not they won't take it away or anything but it's annoying when you constantly hear beep 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 like that's the most annoying thing in the entire world i promise you it's so annoying i promise and you can get it from walmart for 20 dollars. mine's vibrated get you one that lights up so you get if you're used to being on your phone you can look at the blue light or whatever and it just comforts you or whatever sometimes um just get a watch that vibrates please thank you but you're definitely gonna need a 24 hour watch 24 hour because everybody's gonna be talking in military time and it's just you're gonna want to know it because oh, i've seen a couple people with um the standard watches with the thingies and stuff i was like like a watch like this i was just looking at them like what did you but I get it, some people can't afford certain stuff, so I ain't even gonna do that, but just please bring your watch. Just just bring a watch, okay? Just bring a watch. Bring your own cough drops, please. That's another thing that will get you through BMT is cough drops. Like if you have a PT test that day, you wanna pop a cough drop in, it will help you get through and everything. Like if you have PT that day, pop one in and you'll be good. It's something to give you that burst of energy that you probably won't have because you don't eat anything before you do PT. So, yeah. Plus, they're just so good to eat. And if you need extra energy, they have sugar in them. So you can pop one in, especially when you're dozing off and you're gonna want to have something to eat. They will allow you to bring your own cough drops. So bring like the really good kinds. I recommend these. You don't need sanitizer, but bring some if you need. I understand a lot of people that are traveling to BMT that are on the planes and stuff. You might need some sanitizer then, but you won't need it in your dorms and stuff. Once you get to BMT, they issue you with sanitizer so you really don't need it like you won't use it a lot because you'll be washing your hands regardless too when you're at bmt so don't you'll need to bring sanitizer you can bring your toothbrush as well you can bring an electric toothbrush everything um they issue you with the toothbrush so you really don't need to but just in case yours something happens to yours you can still get another one at bmt but you can pack a toothbrush if you want it really just doesn't matter but you can if you want use a comfortable carry-on one that does not give you shoulder pain or back pain or you know one that is very supportive to you um i wish i would have done that like i've seen people with suitcases actually i didn't know you could bring a suitcase but you can so i guess bring a suitcase just bring something that is good a nice decent carry-on because when i know i know when you do leave bmt um you're gonna have your your green duffel bag on your back 
and then you're gonna have your backpack that they give you on your shoulders in front of you and then you're gonna have your carry-on so I'm not sure if they let you roll it I, I don't think they let you roll it at BMT so just bring a comfortable a comfortable carry-on yeah I'm gonna leave it there also guesstimate how much weight you're gonna gain or lose so when you pack clothes think if you're gonna eat a lot of stuff or if you're not gonna eat anything just bring your regular size clothes because when you leave and you go to tech school you have extra clothes there um, that you have from when you brought in and they might not fit and so you're gonna be looking crazy on the weekends or whatever or if you get sent to med hole god forbid you're gonna want some comfortable clothes to bring you know you don't have to bring spandex as well to be honest you really don't have to um but you can bring comfortable spandex you really don't need it honestly you can just cut out the things of your shorts um it's like it's like a fishnet type thing in there i forgot what it's called but something you can just cut that out that's completely fine i mean maybe you can bring one pair of spandex one pair of nike spandex and you should be good i promise you also your undergarments do not matter for guys you get extra undergarments i guess because some guys just don't wear it or something <laughs> y'all get extra of those because i remember packing it and everything but for girls, you can bring any kind of underwear you want. Like, it really does not matter, any type of underwear. But you do want to bring one extra bra. You want to have your regular traditional bra. And then, other than that, bring like four. This is the one thing you want to pack up on, sports bras. Pack up on like four or five sports bras. Oh, and bring chapstick. That's something you can bring. But other than that, that's it. You don't really need to bring earrings. Um, you don't need them. Um, for pictures they tell you you can't have them on so yeah also i would bring a travel size thing of neosporin and a couple band-aids because you're definitely going to get hurt while you're there <laughs> i think i think that's everything for this packing list um pack light because you don't want to carry so much stuff and it just gets heavy especially if you pick something up from the mini mall um you get some gifts you want to put them in your civilian luggage before you know it that thing gets heavy so pack light and i think that's everything that you need to bring for bmt thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed the video please don't forget to leave a like comment down below any video suggestions you guys may have again thank you guys so much for watching and